Hello everyone. My camera was about to focus on everything else apart from my face. Which is crazy. That is a new development up in my face and that is these glasses. I got these glasses yes day before yesterday and these are essentially just those glasses there it's not anti-glare it's like the lens cut blue something glasses you see recently i've been doing a lot online and i've always like i think i used to be online about six or seven hours on the computer um, when I was editing but now it has gone to I think about like 10 hours a day even more actually I think about like 12 or like 13 hours a day I'm either on the laptop or I'm on my phone so I thought maybe not ruin my eyes more and get these these kind of fancy you know when I was little I used to think that every single person that's smart has to wear glasses and because I didn't wear glasses I wasn't smart well i actually really like these ones they're very very light they don't have that thing around the nose that can kind of like hamper anything and it's not really that tight around my temples so it's quite comfortable and i can just like put it on like the tip of my nose and just be like yes hello i'm gonna try to make it a tiny bit different because i don't really want to just make it into a vlog because i realized early on in my life that my life is not that interesting so that's why we can't really do a vlog all over again because a day in my life is literally it's the same day every day okay maybe sometimes it's different but most of the time it's the same so it's quite boring so what i'm going to do today now i'm working on the website that's going to be launched for Coppola's first ever product launch. Um, if you guys don't know, Coppola is a brand that I've already launched, but we are about to launch our first ever product. So I'm working on that. If you want to know more about Coppola or the first product that we're going to launch, you can go to www.coppola.com, sign in on our mailers list, and you're going to be the first to know when exactly we launch, what exactly we launch, and I'm really, really excited about it. Anyways, uh, let's do this for about an hour or two hours. And then I'm gonna go make some lunch. Then we're gonna be talking about PMS. It's the devil, I tell you. Okay, bye. So I ended up making dosa, sambar, and some potato filling. As usual, this is something that I really like to eat, like even as breakfast or lunch. So both of the meals, I don't really mind this. And yeah, it's really yum yum. So I'm just gonna sit there have one dosa with my yummy stuffing and some sambar om nom 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 there's one thing that i absolutely love about sambar and that is these drumsticks i chew the shit out of these drumsticks and i absolutely love them and these drumsticks love me because they're nutritious as hell do you guys like these drumsticks i love them apparently there's different ways of eating it and i eat like this should i put these on I finished my lunch and I want to talk about PMS and this is this is like a single video that I'm gonna upload um, randomly it's not you must be wondering why exactly do I go randomly MIA um, after like few weeks of uploading consistently and I have a very very good point about that the biggest issue with me has become PMS after turning 30 PMS has just been off the roof um, for some visual difference there's a physical difference there's a mental difference and I can actually tell that I'm either PMSing or I'm about to get my period. And it's not something that's normal. It is, it has been really, really difficult. And I don't really know how to handle it. And that's the reason why I'm actually doing this video. I really want your tips and how exactly you handle PMS after you've turned 30. Because I feel like PMS before you turn 30 was completely different and now it's completely different so for me what I feel when I am PMSing is that I just feel so void of any feeling like I don't feel anything one of the biggest problems with my PMS is that my whole body hurts I feel like I'm tired all the time I feel like I can't focus on one thing the past week I had all these ideas, I had every single thing planned that I'm gonna do. Um, I had like every single thing scheduled out. 
and the second I woke up on a Monday last Monday I just felt this huge weight on my body and I couldn't really like move I I pushed myself up and I ended up um, sitting on my chair and I'm not even joking guys I sat on my work desk for a solid four hours staring at the screen not knowing what exactly I was doing but knowing what I was doing but feeling like I have no idea what's happening it is such a trip to be PMSing now and I'm really really concerned I don't really know whom to go to if I should go to a psychologist if I should go to a gynecologist like what exactly I should do because I cannot as somebody that's about to start a business I cannot have a whole week where I am literally just like not in the zone you know what I mean and I really I really need help and I would absolutely love it if you guys let me know how exactly your PMS has been going um, specifically after the age of 30 because I have heard that it, it hits you after 30 and please let me know um, how exactly you tackle it I've only been able to find out two things that I can do to help my PMS one is to go exercise even on situations that I don't feel like exercising when I'm PMSing because my whole body hurts and I feel really tired and I feel loopy and I feel sleepy but um, the good thing is that if I push myself enough, if I do go to the gym, specifically weight training, if I do that, after that I feel a bit better. And the second thing is a mixed tea that I make for myself. But yeah, it's been, it's been pretty crazy the last week and that's the reason why I didn't really upload anything. I couldn't, I don't think I did anything the last week. Maybe I started feeling a tiny bit better. So I started scheduling every single thing. But guys, it is so... I don't know what's happening I really don't there's no literature around like I tried to search for how exactly to tackle this and the only two things I found was like exercise and like the green tea that's about it and I really I really wish I'm pretty sure a lot of you are also going through the same thing so please let me know in the comment section what exactly do you do to tackle your PMS mine has been going really crazy and I don't really think I can continue with this like as it's going on I really wish it wasn't there it's a huge hamper to my work to my well-being it feels like nothing I feel like nothing um, a week before my period and it's just I, I don't really know it is a huge concern for me and that's the reason why I'm making this video also I'm really sorry guys that I didn't upload a video last week I know I always keep on saying I'm sorry I didn't upload last week but literally it happens every single month I'm consistent and I'm there for like three weeks and then one week is just shit that's where it is and it's either the end of that week that I become non shit again <laughs> but it is a horrible horrible feeling I wouldn't ever like wish this on anyone and I know a lot of you are also going through it so please please tell me how do you deal with your PMS because I my patience level is like this this tiny now and I didn't really want to make this video about like a vlog or anything because I that's not what this is about I just I have a lot of questions and I have a lot of concerns and I just want to ask you guys how exactly it's been going and a lot of you were messaging me Kumala are you okay <laughs> because I didn't post anything for the last week so this is just a disclaimer I'm fine now but every single month it keeps this keeps happening for like at least one week and I don't think I can continue like this it is extremely I don't even I, there, there's no word for it it's just annoying it's let me know what exactly you did with your PMS or like you know whom did you talk to about your PMS or what exactly did you do with your PMS that you stopped happening or like maintaining it that's about it bye I hope I could say this bye to PMS I swear to god anyways bye